afternoon, darling. Hi. Now, that isn't what I'd call an enthusiastic greeting. Well, it's just that you startled me. Hmm. Where have you been? Persia, darling. The show Xanadu was becoming drearily insistent. So I decided to teach him a lesson to disappear. <laughs> but I'm really hooked on his hookah. <laughs> He's probably tearing the palace inside out looking for it. <laughs> Mother, um, uh, would you mind changing? Why, darling? Well, I I'm expecting Darren's mother any minute. And, uh, hide your hookah. Oh, you <laughs> poor thing. Darling, why don't you come to the palace with me? The show isn't that dreary. <laughs> oh, uh, Mother, please. Oh. <laughs> Thank Hello. you. Yes. I'm sorry to be late, Samantha. Is my adorable granddaughter up from her nap yet? No, not not for a while. Uh, you you remember my mother? Oh yes. Uh, how terribly nice to see you. <laughs> Do you live here now? Live here? Whatever gave you that idea? Well, it's it's just that every time I visit, she's here. Oh, it's just a coincidence. A happy coincidence. Samantha, darling, I'm sure you and Mrs. Uh, uh, <laughs> Stevens have so many things to talk about. Um, I think I'll be going. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> here, let me take your coat. Where, um, where, where, where did she go? Well, when, uh, my mother says she's going, she goes. <laughs> but, um, but, uh, but, but just... Uh, wh why are we standing here? Let's go in and sit down. Come on. <laughs> Actually, I'm glad we have this chance to talk because, because I've been thinking. Oh? And what I've been thinking is that um, you'll need a maid. A maid? What for? Well, it'll give you time to socialize with the people who can boost Darren up the ladder of success. What people are those? Well, for instance, there's Mrs. Endicott Otis. Her husband practically runs the community, and I would never have met her if I didn't sacrifice those two days a week at the League of Women Volunteers. Well, I, I feel that I make my fair contribution to charity and still have time to take care of our home. That must explain why you look so tired and drawn. <laughs> tired and drawn? Samantha, I'm going to arrange for you to meet Mrs. Otis. Now, it wouldn't do for her to think that Darren couldn't afford a maid, would it? Mrs. Stevens, I don't know why I've been fighting you. We definitely need a maid. <laughs>